Hi everybody, this is Lindsay from WindingRoadCrochet.com. This is part three of the Desert Sunset Shaw. I hope you're enjoying this video tutorial. If you are, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. So we're starting where we left off. We're on row 22 and you'll start row 22 by chaining three and then you'll turn your work. Work two double crochet into the very first stitch. Chain one and skip the next stitch and work into the following stitch. And this is going to re be our repeat all the way down. We're making an open stitch row here. So you'll chain one, skip the next stitch, and work into the following stitch. Continue repeating this until you reach the chain two point at the center. As we near the chain two point in the center, we're going to work a double crochet in the second to last stitch before the chain two space. And then we will chain one, skip the last stitch, and work two double crochet, two chain, two double crochet into our chain two center. So double crochet once, twice, chain once, chain twice, turn and continue working in the chain two space, two more double crochet. From here we'll chain one, skip the next stitch, and double crochet into the following stitch. So then you'll chain one again, skip the following stitch, and double crochet into the next stitch. And just repeat this until you reach close to the end of this row. So here we are at the end of this row. We're going to work a two double crochet into our very last stitch. So you'll chain one, skip the second to last stitch, and then work two double crochet into the very last stitch. And that is the end of this row. So we will chain three to start our next row turn our work, work two double crochet into the very first stitch, one and two, and then work a double crochet into the next stitch here. Now we can start our repeat, chain one, skip the chain space and double crochet into the next stitch. Chain one, skip the chain space and double crochet into the next stitch. And we'll continue repeating this, chain one, double crochet into the next stitch until we reach that chain two point in the middle. So we come up on our center point, we're going to chain one, skip the last chain space here, work into the next stitch, a double crochet. Chain one and skip the last stitch before the chain two space. In our chain two space, we're gonna work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. So one double crochet, two double crochet, chain one, chain two, Work another double crochet and our last double crochet into the chain two space at the center. Now you can chain one, skip the next stitch and work into the following. Chain one, starting our repeat again, skip the chain space, work into the next stitch. Chain one again, Skip the chain space, work into the next double crochet, and just keep repeating this until we come to the end of the row. We're at the end of the row, working the last chain space, we're gonna chain one, work a double crochet into the second to last stitch of this row, 
and then work two double crochet into the very last stitch. And now we're ready to start the next row. We'll start the next row by chaining three and turning our work. We're going to work two double crochet into the very first stitch. From here we will chain one, skip the next stitch, and work into the following stitch. And this will be another open space row. Open stitch work. So chain one, skip the chain space, work into the next stitch. Chain one, skip the next space, work into the next stitch. And you'll continue repeating this until you reach the center point of this pattern, of this row. We've made it up to the center point. We're going to chain one, skip the last chain space, work into the second to last stitch before our chain two space, chain one, and then start working into the chain two space in the center. So we're going to work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. Chain one, chain two, work two more double crochet for the other side of our point. And we're ready to start our repeat again. Chain one, skip the stitch, move into the second stitch, work a double crochet. Chain one, skip the chain space, work into the next stitch. Chain one, skip the chain space, and work into the next stitch. And simply repeat this until you're close to the end of this row. So we've made it to the end of this row. We will chain one, work into the next stitch, skipping the chain space. Chain one, skip the next stitch, and work two double crochet into the very last stitch. And that completes the row. So it's our third row of open stitch. Chain three, turn your work, and we'll start the next row. Gonna work two double crochet into the very first stitch. Work a double crochet into the next stitch. Chain one. We'll do another row of open stitch crochet. Skip your chain space and work a double crochet into the next stitch. Chain one. Skip the space and work a double crochet into the next stitch. Chain one again, skip the space, work a double crochet into the next stitch, and you'll continue repeating this just like the last few rows all the way to your center point. So we're up to the center point. We're going to chain one, skip the last chain space, work a double crochet into the second double crochet from the chain two space. Chain one and begin working into the chain two space. We'll work two double crochet chain two, two double crochet. Work one double crochet, work our second double crochet, chain one and chain two, and then work two more double crochet on the other side of the point. All right, now we're going to chain one, skip the next stitch, and work into the following stitch. Then we will be able to start our repeat again. Chain one, skip the chain space, 
work into the double crochet and repeat chain one skip the chain space work into the next stitch repeat this until you get close to the end of the row so here we are working our last repeat you'll chain one work a double crochet into the second to last stitch of the row and then work two double crochet into the very last stitch of the row. And that should complete our last row of open stitch. Start the next row, we will chain three, turn our work, work two double crochet into the first stitch, double crochet into the next stitch, double crochet into the stitch after that, and now we are going to double crochet into every chain space and every stitch until we reach the chain 2 center point. Double crochet into the chain space, and double crochet into the stitch and just continue repeating that to the center. So we're just going to work a double crochet into the last chain space and then a double crochet in each of the next two stitches. For our chain two space and our center point we're going to work two double crochet chain two, two double crochet. So one double crochet, two double crochet, chain one, chain two, work two more double crochet along the other side. Still working into our chain two space. And then continuing with a solid row of double crochet, we'll work a double crochet into the next two stitches, one and two, and then continue with our repeat of working a double crochet into the chain space and a double crochet into the next stitch. Double crochet into the next chain space and a double crochet into the next stitch. And you'll repeat this until you're almost at the end of the row. Coming up to the end of the row, we're going to work a double crochet into the last chain space and then work a double crochet into the next two stitches and work two double crochet into the very last stitch. and that completes our solid double crochet row. For our next row, we'll start by chaining three, two, three, turn our work, and this is gonna be another solid double crochet row. Start by working two double crochet into the very first stitch, and simply work a double crochet into each stitch until you reach the chain two center. All right, so we're gonna work the last double crochet before our chain two space, and then in the chain two space, we'll work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. And two more double crochet into the chain two space. And then we'll continue working one double crochet into each stitch until we reach the last stitch of this row.
So I'm working a double crochet into the second to last stitch from the end of the row and two double crochet into your very last stitch. And that completes our second row of solid double crochet. Starting our next row, we're going to chain three. And we're going to make one more row of solid double crochet. So work two double crochet into the very first stitch. And then one double crochet in every stitch until you reach the chain two at the center point. So I'm working the last stitch before our chain two space, the center. And then for the center, we're going to work two double crochet, one and two, chain two, one, two, and two more double crochet. So one more and another, all in the two, that chain two space. That makes our point. And then working down the other side, we're going to keep doing what we were doing on the other side, which is double crocheting into each stitch until you reach your very last stitch. All right, so we're working the second to last stitch from the end, and then in our very last stitch, we'll work two double crochet. one and two. And that completes our third row of solid double crochet. We've had a nice color change. The next row we will chain three, turn our work, work two double crochet into the very first stitch, We will chain one, skip the next stitch, and work a cluster stitch into the following stitch. So same as we've been doing for all the other rows, it's a three double crochet cluster stitch. So you'll make three half double crochets and pull them together at the end. From here, chain one, skip the next stitch, and work a double crochet into the following stitch. And this is going to be our repeat for this row. So we're alternating the double crochet and the cluster stitch. So chain one, skip the next stitch, work a cluster stitch into the following stitch. Close that up, chain one, Skip the next stitch and work a double crochet into the following stitch. And you will continue repeating this until you reach the chain two center. So at the end of our last repeat, we're going to chain one, skip the second to last stitch before the chain two space, work a cluster stitch into the last stitch before the chain two space. We'll work our last cluster stitch. Chain one, and now we'll work a double crochet, two chain, and a double crochet into the chain two space. Chain one, and then work a cluster stitch into the very first stitch. And this is where we're going to start our repeat again. So after the cluster stitch, you will chain one, skip the next stitch, work a double crochet into the following stitch. 
and then repeat again. Chain one, skip the next stitch, work a cluster stitch in the next stitch. Chain one, skip the next stitch, and work a double crochet in the, the following stitch. And just keep repeating this until you reach the end of the row. So we're finishing up the last repeat. We're going to chain one, skip a stitch, and work a cluster stitch to the following stitch. chain one and work two double crochet into your last stitch. And that completes the row. So we're on row 29 and we will start by chaining three and turning our work. And you will work two double crochet into the first stitch, a double crochet into the next stitch, and then a double crochet into every chain space and stitch across. So double crochet into this stitch here, double crochet into the chain space, double crochet into the top of the cluster stitch, double crochet into the next chain space, double crochet into the next double crochet, and then just keep working this until you reach the center uh, chain two at the center point. So we're working into the last cluster stitch, chain space, and stitch of this side of the chain two space, center point. And in our center, we are going to work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. Chain one and chain two work two more double crochet. Now we will continue our repeat on the other side working a double crochet into the next stitch, the next chain space, the next cluster stitch, and the following chain space. And just keep repeating that until you reach the very last stitch of the row. So I'm working a double crochet into the last chain space. We'll work a double crochet into the second to last stitch and two double crochet into the very last stitch. And that is our solid double crochet row. Moving on, we will work three chain and turn our work for the next row. This is another row of solid double crochet. We'll start by working two double crochet into the very first stitch and one double crochet into each stitch until we reach the chain two space. So I'm just finishing the last two stitches before the chain two space. And then once we get to our chain two space, we will work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet into the chain two space to create our center point. One and two chains, and then two more double crochet. 
and then down along the other side we'll continue working one double crochet into each stitch until we reach the very last stitch. Alright, so we're just working the second to last double crochet of this row and then into the very last stitch we'll work two double crochet. That completes the second row of solid double crochet. The next row we will chain three and turn our work and we are going to do a few more rows of open stitch. Start by working two double crochet into the first stitch, chain one, skip the next stitch, and work a double crochet into the following stitch. And this will be our repeat until the chain two at the center. So chain one, skip a stitch, double crochet into the following stitch chain one, skip the next stitch, double crochet into the following stitch, and just repeat this until the chain two space in the center. Alright, so I'm working our last repeat, chain one, skip the second to last stitch from the chain two space, work a double crochet into the last stitch before the chain two space. In our chain two space we're going to work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. So chain one, chain two, work two more double crochet into the chain two space. Work a double crochet into the next stitch and then we'll start our repeat. So we'll chain one, skip a stitch and double crochet into the following stitch chain one, skip a stitch, and double crochet into the following stitch, and just keep repeating this until the end of the row. So as we work our very last repeat, we are going to chain one, skip the second to last stitch in the row, and work two double crochet into the very last stitch of this row. That will be our first row of open stitch and we're going to end up working about five rows like this of open stitch. Our next row will be another row of open stitch. We're going to chain three and turn our work. We're going to work two double crochet into the very first stitch and then one double crochet into the next stitch. Now we can start a repeat of chain one, skip the chain space, and work into the next double crochet stitch. Chain one, skip the chain space, and work into the next stitch. And you're going to repeat this until you reach the chain two space at the center point. So we've reached the center point, we're going to chain one, double crochet in the second to the last, double crochet before the chain two space, then chain one, skip the last double crochet, and work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet into the chain two center. Chain one, chain two, and work two more double crochet into that center point. So there is your center point. Just like the other side, we're going to chain one, skip the next stitch, and work into the following stitch a double crochet. Chain one, skip the next stitch, work a double crochet into the following stitch. And continue with our repeat from the other side all the way until you reach the second to the last stitch of this row. So we've made it to our last repeat. We're going to chain one, double crochet into the second to the last stitch, 
and then work two double crochet into the very last stitch of this row. And now you're ready for the next row. We'll chain three and turn your work. We're working another row of open stitch work. For this row, we'll start by working two double crochet into the first stitch. And then we will chain one, skip the next stitch, and work a double crochet into the following stitch. Chain one, skip the chain space, work a double crochet into the following stitch. And just continue repeating this until you reach the chain two space. So we've reached our last repeat. We're going to chain one, work a double crochet into the second to last stitch before the chain two space, chain one, and now we're working into the chain two space. We'll work two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. Chain one, chain two, two more double crochet. And now working down the other side, we'll chain one, skip the first stitch, double crochet into the next stitch, chain one, skip the chain space, and double crochet into the next stitch. And we'll continue repeating that. Chain one, skip the chain space, double crochet into the next stitch. And repeat that until you reach your end. So we've worked our way down to the end. We're going to skip the last chain space, work a double crochet, chain one, and then work two double crochet into the very last stitch. And this will complete row 33. Go ahead and check out my next video for part four of the Desert Sunset Shaw, and don't forget to subscribe and like this video.